Here is all the New York City tax bill exemptions. Where did we get these? Well, we got them from tax bills. Thanks to taxbills.nyc, where all tax bills are documented, downloaded, parsed. As you can see, all these little codes here are exemptions from tax bills. And as you can see, there are a lot of them. <laughs> and they just go on forever and ever here. Co-op abatements, 421. There's some interesting ones. How did we get all these? Well, that's, again, from that taxbills.nyc, reading every single tax bill in New York City. And it seems like co-op is the most popular one, but there's others. There's all kinds of others. And Chalama. So we're going to explore a couple of them. Let's look at the most interesting one, which is 421. Right down here, we can search on keys with 421. Now this narrows it down to just 421A, or 421B, and others. There's um, Something you can notice here is the number of 421 related exemptions is reducing. 2016, I think, is current, so that might be why it's lower. Now let's take another look. Let's remove the filter and let's look at, for some random reason, let's look at borough president. Look here, borough president. That should show up as an exemption. There you can see it's some large value. Seems strange that in one year the borough president exemption is enormous, and in other years it's almost nothing. Doesn't seem to make sense. 2015, that seems to be a mistake. So let's zoom in on this. That's a pretty large number there for some reason. And it seems to be on this year, 2015. So let's get some more detail about that. We can go over here and look at the raw data. If we search on on the raw data, which is all public in personal real estate NYC tax bills, which contains borough president, you'll see that there are some strange numbers here such as in 2015 there's a large value so let's see for this particular location so let's search for that Go to the tax app and we put in that BBL and then we look at its tax bill and we'll see that right now it's getting an exemption at some property in uh, the Bronx which doesn't seem to have anything to do with the borough president's office and now it's getting an exemption department real estate DCAS but in 2015 it was getting a borough president exemption so this is just a little sample of what can be done with all this data. Thank you.